there's this deep and abiding belief that as people we need to be tough it's a hard world out there you know and, and you need to toughen up if you hope to make it You know, we even say, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. We, we don't ever want to be seen as soft, like, oh, you, you better not mistake my kindness for weakness. I drive an hour to work, which gives me a lot of time to think at the beginning of the day. And obviously I drive an hour at the end of the day, so more time alone with my thoughts. And that can be a wonderful space to explore the universe in my mind. Neil deGrasse Tyson points out that in one molecule of your DNA there are as many atoms as there are stars in the average galaxy. We are all of us little universes. So but very often the things I'm thinking about are not things that I choose but the stressful things that just come to me. Just like life and family, illness, bills, depressive time. The temptation for me sometimes is to switch on the radio and switch off the mind. Washington Irving wrote that love is never lost. If not reciprocated, it will flow back and soften and purify the heart. Sometimes we need to allow the rough things of life to wash over us and wreck us. And instead of putting roughness back out into the world, we need to be deliberate, responding in kindness. The difficult circumstances of life will not only toughen the skin, but also soften the heart, if only we'll let them.